Here, we're going to show you how to put on the rotor. Um, you do have these spacers or washers that are behind the rotor. You need those to level it up, so then that way it fits. Here's your rotor. Um, recommend using Loctite too um, on all the screws. So try to soft place them. Make sure you don't cross thread. It's soft aluminum. If you rush it and smash it through, you will regret it really quickly. Um, it can happen so easily, you'd be shocked. I'm gonna use a power tool here, which I don't recommend doing. I'm just going real slow, so. I always like to hand tighten at the end. You know. So here we are with that. This is a T25 um, torque. So I like to tighten all these, hand tighten, make them at least taunt, don't over tighten. You'll know when it's tight, you'll be like, oh, that's real snug. So make sure you do that. It's real important because your life is on the line with the rotor here. You don't want it to come loose. That's why we use Loctite on all of them. And uh, that's how you do the rear rotor on the Komodo M1100.